Now, Austin officials joining the state and the county calling on schools to teach students about hate symbols. This comes, of course, after that swastika and a racial slur were found in a school bathroom. Nightside Samantha Crawford has this story. Last month, the News 12 investigative unit revealed staggering numbers in the first of its kind two year investigation. After sorting through an enormous amount of data, we found nearly 600 acts of hate in the last several years in the Hudson Valley. Some of it right under children's noses. Of the 596 cases in our database, 8% were in schools. The primary targets were religion and race, with anti Semitism accounting for more than half. As you can see, between 2010 and 2018, Westchester saw the most cases, Rockland following second, and then Putnam and Orange counties. We can't wait. We have to be proactive and make sure that we're getting to our children first. State Senator David Carlucci gravely concerned by our findings and how the rise in hate incidents could affect New York's youth. He's co-sponsoring legislation that calls for students in the 6th through 12th grade to be educated about hate symbols. If the state does not act, do you think this almost gives birth to a whole new type of way of thinking when it comes to diversity? I think it is. I think that we have to change the paradigm. We can't just be reacting to the symbols that we see if it pops up in a, in a public park or if it pops up uh, on social media. Since compiling our data, swastikas have been found in Scarsdale High School, Pelham Middle School, Pleasantville High School, and just this week, the anti-Semitic symbol and a racial slur were found sketched in an Austin High School bathroom. The school superintendent says this is the first time this has happened in any of his schools. It seems to be a you know an isolated situation, but one we're taking very, very seriously, and there's no place for this in our school settings. Within 24 hours, elected officials of all levels gathered in Austin Village Hall to formally announce their unanimous support of bringing lessons about hate into their schools. We need to come together and solve this problem at the earliest levels. Village Mayor Victoria Garrity says she supported the bill before Thursday's incident, telling us the rise in hate around her community pushed her into action. It's an important message for young people to get. They're a call to violence. They are a way to divide our community and could lead to incredible harm. The Austin Police Chief Kevin Sylvester says this epidemic of hate is not only a social issue, but also a safety issue. Something that's never not on your mind, in particular in our schools, because this is where we're, we're developing our next generation and we're building their minds. Austin officials say even if the statewide bill is not passed, they would like to bring age-appropriate lessons in their schools. For News 12, I'm Samantha Crawford.